These are the top seven explosives in Minecraft. Number one is the Creeper. In Minecraft, the Creeper is a hostile mob which, when either lit by flint and steel or gets too close to the player, it will explode. This explosion radius is pretty good, but not the most explosive thing in Minecraft. Number two is the Charged Creeper. The Charged Creeper is when a Creeper gets struck by lightning, it turns into a Charged Creeper. Now, the Charged Creeper does way more damage and has a way bigger blast radius than the regular Creeper, which makes sense because it has been struck by lightning. This could be possibly one of the biggest explosions that I have ever seen. Number three is the fire charge. Now, the fire charge is usually shot by a gas, but we have recreated it with this uh, dispenser and lever, but this will shoot a fireball out and, well, it doesn't really do anything when we shoot them. It only sets things on fire, but when a gas shoots them, it does a pretty big explosion. Number four is the respawn anchor. Now, the respawn anchor is usually used in the nether, and you fill it up with glowstone. But in the overworld, if you fill it up, it will explode. Number five is good old TNT. Now, TNT is, of course, one of the things that usually comes to your mind when you think of explosions. And it has a pretty good blast radius, and this is taking forever to blow up. But yeah, um... It's got a really good explosion. And I think that that's all for this one. Let's head to the next one. Number six is the end crystal. And the end crystal is obviously found in the end, but they are also craftable in survival. Now, they do need to be placed on either bedrock or obsidian. But I'd say if it's, it's worth it to craft these because they give off a huge explosion. I mean, it's so big. And it's about the size of a charged creeper explosion. The final explosive is number seven, which is the bed. Now, the bed is usually used for sleeping in the overworld, right? You can't, you can't explode it. But if you go to the nether or the end, it gives off an explosion, which makes it really easy to mine for netherite or any resources you need in the nether by just crafting a whole bunch of beds and then just exploding them all in the nether to just find those resources that you might need. If you guys enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Bye.